wanted the best, you've got the best podcast. The hottest, hottest. podcast in the world. In the world. The Chris Voss Show, the preeminent podcast with guests so smart you may experience serious brain bleed. Get ready, get ready. Strap yourself in. Keep your hands, arms, and legs inside the vehicle at all times because you're about to go on a monster education roller coaster with your brain. Now, here's your host, Chris Voss. Hi, folks. Chris Voss here from the Chris Voss Show.com. The Chris Voss Show.com. Hey, we're coming here with an great podcast. We certainly appreciate you guys tuning in. Man, we're covering Infocom 2022 in Las Vegas. Lots of fun that's uh, going on down there. Tons of the latest technologies and different things you're going to want to see and hear about. So stay tuned for our coverage of that. Uh, today, We have an amazing booth that's being shown right now at Infocom. So if you're at Infocom, you'll be able to go by and see their stuff or go to their website and check them out and everything they're doing. Z-Band Technologies LLC is on the phone with us today. And we've got Dan Helfrich, the vice president on the phone. He's down at the booth there in Las Vegas. Uh, Welcome to the show. Dan, how are you? I'm doing really well, Chris. I got the... Got to have a little bit of fun already this week. Got some climbing in, and now definitely excited to get uh, get the show started. Awesome sauce! So today's the first day of Infocom 2022, and uh, what's your booth number for those people who want to come by the booth there? So our booth is N, as in Nancy, one two five four. There you go. And what's uh, what's your website so people can check you out on the interwebs too as well? Sure, you can find us on the interweb at www.z-band.com. There you go. And there'll be a link on the Chris Voss Show, too, you can click to go. So uh, swing by the booth, check it out. Uh, There's going to be a lot of technologies. Is there a section of uh, the CES show? I know there's different wings. There's the South Hall and the the North Hall, a certain hall. Sure. So we are in the North Hall, and uh, Infocom this year is taking up the North and, and West Halls, from what I can see. I actually haven't had the opportunity to go over to the West Hall yet. I'm excited to see that one. That's the, the new one since Infocom was, was here previously. So I haven't made it over there yet, but I'm excited to get to do that. There you go. So what are you guys showing With, off? I'm sorry. So what are you guys no, showing go, off go right at ahead. the booth? What are you guys showing off the booth this year? So... At the booth this year, we have actually a wide range of products. Uh, Z-Band has made its name in video distribution, television distribution services. So we have our traditional uh, RF over twisted pair platform, which is uh, big in in healthcare, still our number one seller on an annual basis. Um, We've updated that pretty significantly. So the RF performance is much cleaner. There's a lot more control over what you can do with that system. We also have a variety of IPTV and live streaming options. We've got uh, web-based encoding that can go out so rtmp rtmps for facebook youtube twitch those types of applications also local multicast streaming um so udp rtp any of your traditional corporate iptv platforms and also uh new this year to the products that is a 4k encoder that does srt broadcast as well so if you want to do over the internet or point-to-point transmission with error correction we have uh, options for that and then the latest product that we're releasing actually just got the provisional patent uh, information filed this week is for our head end controller product which is actually geared towards a big hole that we see in the market in legacy systems mm. where we have so many people that uh, have coax systems coax infrastructures still um, these days for their television and video services but they're handled by IT directors or uh, biomedical engineers, basically people who don't have the, the skill set and the training in RF and want to get some visibility into what their television system and television network is doing. Um, so we have, it's called our head end controller uh, product. It's a working name. We don't have an official release name yet, um, but that one is geared towards helping out all these folks who've had to take over coax plants as a part of their job get a little bit of uh, visibility and control over that coax infrastructure nice so who are your who are your clients well let's do this uh let's talk about what what do you do as a broad thing there at z-band incorporated what, what products and stuff do you usually cover and we cut we touched on a little bit but let's let's get down to the core of the company sure um so the easiest way to think of z-band is kind of as a pipe that connects the portions of your television and video system um you say you're building a healthcare facility 
we got 400 beds, 400 patient rooms that need to get TV services and patient engagement and all that other kind of stuff. Um, so you're going to have your feed coming in from Comcast or DirecTV, Dish Network, and it needs to get out to the patient rooms. Well, we provide the infrastructure that allows you to get that television out to the patient rooms. Uh, our RF system does it all over category cable. We have an IPTV system that will allow you to do that as multicast. And then depending on which system you go with, there's software controls uh, to get some visibility into the system, the traffic flow. Um, and then also we can inject, uh, we have partnerships with a couple of companies for digital signage to be able to do that kind of stuff. We have a partnership with Atmosphere, who's also here at this show, um, to allow you to do kind of web-based content creation and inject like a Bob Ross channel, Puppies and Kittens channel, that kind of stuff. So we have our traditional infrastructure product, but we also have a couple of partnerships that allow you to inject your own channels or, or, or do some things at the receive end as well. Awesome sauce. I mean, it's pretty cool. And you guys work for, you guys work with military uh, hosp hosp hospitals uh, and, and uh, a lot of different things there in, in your space. Uh, what else, uh, what are some other things that people are, you've got maybe coming in the near future that you're uh, teasing out maybe at the show? Uh, so the head and controller is a, a pre-release product. That's definitely the big one we're teasing at the show. Um, there are some new advancements to the IPTV system, specifically on the digital signage and layout creation, um, that you can see here at the show. And to kind of touch on what you were just talking about there, we're seeing a lot of growth as Z band in the corporate kind of fortune 500 fortune 1000 uh, you know uh, fortune 100 space right now mm -hmm. where you have customers that are doing their traditional tv you got 8 10 12 channels of television services that they want to send out for like a financial institution but then they also want to integrate some video messaging you know welcome uh, we we work with a company in Gaithersburg who just did a big welcome event their ceo made a, a bloomberg hot list and they did a big event for his, you know, the publication of that. They had welcome messages for everyone that was coming in. And then you could flip immediately from the welcome messages to the traditional TV. They do corporate events, messaging. Um, so it's an integrated kind of digital signage platform along with the IPTV side of things. And, and where we're really going to see advancements it with that platform is going to be with, with some of the digital signage capabilities. And you can get a, a little preview of what's coming at the show. Awesome sauce. Uh, we'll be putting up a picture of you guys' booth there. It looks pretty awesome. I'm looking on, on Facebook. Uh, anything more you want to tease out on the show, what you guys are doing, and uh, get people to come check out your website and get to know more about you? Uh, I, no, honestly, no. Nothing else to, to tease out from a product standpoint. I do just want to say, though, we're very excited to see a, a fuller exhibition hall and get back out. And really, with, with Infocom this year, that was what we wanted to do. Is we wanted to make sure that we had a team out you know, had a presence out there and kind of show everybody that we are we're still here going strong and we're excited for what 2022 and 2023 have to bring for us there you go there you go well thanks for coming on the show we really appreciate it give us your dot com and your booth number again at infocom sure uh, you can find us at booth number n1254 and on the interwebs at www.z-band.com there you go. Thanks for coming on the show, Dan. Have a great show, as they always say. Thank you very much, Chris. Looking forward to it. There you go. Thanks, my honest, for tuning in. Be sure to check them out. Uh, go to Infocom 2022 or go check out their website at z-band.com. There'll be a link on the Chris Voss show as well. Thanks for tuning in. Be good to each other. Stay safe. And we'll see you guys next time. And that should take us out, man. Good, good pitch, Dan. Dan? Yeah, um, stumbled over one spot.